What's up, Hugh Griffs? I'm back with a pretty decent mail day today. Um, best one in weeks. Seriously. So, got a few things to show you. I got some football. Got some Lions. Got some UFC. Got some baseball. Got a little more Lions. And I got a pickup, which I'll show first. No, I'm going to show this one first. This is courtesy of Ricky Russo. There's another card. Um, I'll show later but awesome for the Bowman prospects PC Alan Hansen I've actually tried getting him TTM a couple times to no prevail so very cool to get that thank you Ricky and I uh, picked this up for the Jordan baseball PC and the beautiful card um, got it for a nice price too could have been a nicer price. I originally saw it, it was uh man dudes don't tape the top of cards. I hate it. Just put it in like a team bag. And if you tape it, use painter's tape. Alright. So got this Jordan. The hollow view blue. So that the card's wicked. It's wicked. I wish there's more clarity on my computer, but it is what it is. So this one's been out for well over a year. I don't remember sending this card. I think I sent two cards. I thought I sent a rookie too. I know I sent this because I figured it looked nice signed, which it does. Johnny Morton. So that's awesome one for the Lions PC. Um, I have a couple of uh, autograph cards of him already. He kept my Lions logo photo, but it's cool to still get that back. So, thank you, Johnny. And I got this guy. Former heavyweight champion. The UFC card. And this is who it is. Junior Dos, San Dos Santos. Dos Santos. So that's cool. Very cool. That I mean, that's been out a really long time because that's before I was making customs. Um, right here for the rookie of the year scrapbook. I've been seeing people get him back recently. <clears throat> Sandy Alomar on the custom. That's nice. Happy to get that one. And then I. Uh, on this custom one I did too. These are some of my earlier customs also. So that's very cool. Um, so, got this guy back again. And the custom, the Legends of the Gridiron custom. Eli Manning. And I love this dude, okay? A lot of Lions fans are mad at him right now. But fuck you guys, because this guy is the shit, and we are all family. This right here, I've been seeing people get him in. So what up to the Stout and to Tyler, because those are the people that I saw getting him in. That is Golden Tate. He had said something about Lions fans walking out on the game, how they need to support them, which I 100% agree. Like, I'm going to a game, if we were down by 50, I'd, I wouldn't leave it. But this is from my birthday last year, October 19th, when we beat the, uh, the Saints. And this is actually a picture I took personally of him scoring a touchdown. You know, was, I did like three clicks. This was the best one as he was going in the end zone. You can tell the ref's about to put his arms up. But Golden Tate had a nasty game that, that game. As you see, it's hard, kind of hard to see. This was a 79-yard touchdown that led to our rally for our win. 
but oh his stats are on the other one but golden tape posterized 10 19 14 so that's all good stuff got that and then he signed this one this just shows you how good my seats were and how good my camera is for being non uh, not considered a professional camera as you see I took the photo he's like standing at about like the 10 I think but he had 154 yards on 10 catches and a touchdown so he beasted that game so that is, that's beautiful guys so what up to any of my fellow Lions fans that don't want to get rid of Matthew Stafford which I mean I can't even turn on social media or the TV or anything right now because I mean it's just hate man and I'm sorry if a team's averaging one yard a carry the defense knows what you're gonna do and there's no blocking to give you time for a play to develop and you constantly have to just dump it immediately and you got people saying that they know literally what you're gonna do three games in a row the, the uh, opposing team has said that they knew what we were gonna do they said that on the Corey Redding interception where he tapped the ball to himself that they knew as soon as the Lions lined up that it was gonna be a screen pass and guess what he faded out on it tapped the ball to himself and took it down for 30 yards and, and Stafford's the one that gets blamed for that bullshit bullshit you have to know how to call a game you have to, it's a, it's that is a chess match a chess match and it has to be coach versus coach and I mean it ain't yeah plays have to be executed but you have to design a play that can be executed so that's what I got I'm gonna do another video to show you some of these customs that I just got in and uh cute graphs y'all have a good one later